Hello everyone. Namaste and welcome back to our channel. I hope all of you are doing well. And today in this video, we are going to talk about how to have a quick review of the existing site condition without necessarily going into a detailed survey process. As a designer, there are times when we need to have immediate access of the survey data of specific area for its effective planning and design. So in that case, Google Earth comes in handy for establishing the desired information. And this video is going to uncover all of this. So let's dive in it and I hope you will stay tuned throughout the video to avoid any confusions. Alright, here we are in the Google Earth. And for this demonstration video, I am going to select some particular places as our survey area. As you can see over here. All right, all right. I'm going to select this particular portion to be our study area, okay? Of which we need to extract the survey data. So for this, we need to click over this add part button over this tab and give it some random name. So I'm going to give it as a survey data. So after this, let us first demarcate the boundary of our survey area so that it will ease us. So let us force the market the boundary like this. So after this, let us be sure that you add as many points as you can because it will somehow ensure the accuracy of our survey data. Yeah, so let's have some fun. Yeah, so once you finish adding up the points, you should click OK over here and we will export it as a KML file, okay? So yeah, let us save it. Yeah, after this, uh, we'll go to the any of web browser and just type GPS visualizer. Yeah, this is the website from where we extract the altitude or elevation okay but before extracting the elevation data let me share you something yeah we can have extracted the elevation data by using other method also we can even use arcgis directly and also we can use global mapper yeah so there are a lot of things uh, and a lot of other applications softwares or other steps also from which you can export the elevation data but uh, in this video i am going to tease you by using this gps visualizer website yeah so for extraction process of uh, elevation we should click over this lookup elevation over here yeah so and after that we should upload the file which we have previously saved yeah so we, we upload it and here we should click plain text over here so yes after this uh, we click convert and add elevation button over here yeah and here it is all the altitude data has been successfully extracted so after this we download it okay like this so yes the download has been completed so let's just open this and yeah you can see over here all the x y and z coordinate has been successfully extracted and yeah we can use it as a survey data yeah here this latitude and longitude has been extracted using the google Earth, whereas this altitude has been extracted using this gps visualizer website okay yeah, but before using this uh, survey data, let us be sure that this X and Y coordinate is in the form of latitude and longitude, okay? So before using it, uh, we must uh, convert it in our respective coordinate system, okay? Alright everyone, so this is how we can get our survey data extracted using the Google Earth without even necessarily going to the detailed survey process. Yeah, but as I have already mentioned, the extracted survey data is in the form of the latitude and longitude that need to be converted into our respective coordinate system, that is a UTM system or say Easting and Norting before using the survey data directly. So yeah, 
uh, if you want to learn how to convert the latitude and longitude uh, into the UTM system, then do comment. I will be back with uh, part 2 video for this, okay? So, till then, keep loving my YouTube family. Take care. Bye-bye.